Uh, so as you can see, there's a bit of interference here between folding the canes down and getting it as tight as possible uh, because when this comes up, it sort of takes up the space for these guys to go down. Um, so if you didn't have the, these on, it would go a little easier. But anyway, um, I'm gonna flip these back up to bring it up. I'm gonna pull this open and push down here. Um, I'm putting my wheels back on and I'm pulling back to check that they're properly attached each time. Checking it's on. Gonna roll around to the front here, putting this hanger back on, putting it in and rotating it in. Again, putting it in, rotating it in, putting this back on. We can do this guy. Again, this on this model in particular, I go back get my two bottom pins into the hooks down here. Let's see if I can show that to you. I'm getting them just into the hooks down there. And then I just rotate the back up. Um, and I'm listening for two clicks and I can check to make sure my back is on. Is it on on this other side? Let me see. No, it's not. So I just tug it a little bit more and now we've got it. Um, then I'm going to want to put my privacy. Uh, so you guys want to see that? Um, just going to put my privacy screen back on here and pull it off over here. And uh, um, generally speaking, you always want to have a solid seat insert inside your um, seat cushion if you don't have uh, like if you have a if you have a sling or a cloth seat here because that'll just prevent um, you from hammocking too much in the seat so check that you've got your solid seat insert in there um, and then just slide your cushion uh, however you need to put it in um, yeah uh, if you've got um, an air cushion you want to make sure it's properly inflated. This cushion has some gel in it at the back so you can knead it to make sure it's um, still good there. Um, and yeah, that's it.